What is up folks, Jorge Nito here. Thanks for stopping by and welcome back. Guys, today we're doing episode two of Craig Mystery Box because I come home from work once again, actually on my lunch break, and I'm met with at the door um, what looks like a treasure chest um, minus the lock and key. It's about the size of it. Um, yeah, we'll just, yeah, this is it right here. So um, I have no idea what's inside. Yeah, so, I don't know. Uh, and you know, there's a certain type of, not really anxiety, maybe nervousness that comes with making this video, kind of like the other one, because I always have a certain exu uh, control over the videos, what with the editing, and I know what I'm I'm looking for, and, and now I just, I, I don't know what to expect. I know that Craig has informed me. Um, I don't know what's in it, but he says there's a certain way to go about opening these, so I'm kind of nervous. Uh, we'll see what happens. But, you know, I just, uh, big thanks to Craig for, once again, uh, just being so generous and so kind to, uh, s send some stuff my way. I'm very humbled and thankful, and, you know what? Maybe Craig is actually Santa Claus. This guy with this alias Craig, I bet he really is. Has to be Santa. All right, guys, let's check it out. All right, guys, so let's get into it. All right, so right out the gate, we are met with mystery box number two. He's also been so kind to include um, my favorite card, which is the Joker. Super cool. Art of Play. Elephant sticker. And this really cool card. So, I'll just read it here. It says, Jorge. It's dated for July 17th. Today is the 20th. Um, it says, I had a blast making this for you. Open the bonus deck first. Then follow the order one through five. I figured a half brick of cards was better than just five. Wow. Um, this has been a blast, and thanks for the friendship. Cheers, Craig. Wow, I don't know what to say. Um, <laughs> yeah, it's it, it's been uh, it's been great, man. It's just making these videos and doing these. Um, it's really been exciting, what with the giveaway and and everything. So, I'm going to try to be careful here. Okay, so right on top is the bonus. I have no idea what he's sending me. Very nice. Red rider backs. You know, I have a couple decks of the blue rider backs. This is my first red. So, yeah, thank you so much. How awesome. My blue seal collection is slowly but surely growing. Excellent. Thank you so much, Craig. That was a super sweet bonus. Okay, followed by... Deck number one, is that how he said? Yeah, order one through five, okay. Okay, so this would be number one, and let's see here. Oh my gosh, dude, no way a tom mollica signed deck um i know what these are because i've watched craig's deck collection video you can see right there the tom foolery signed by mr tom mollica himself oh my gosh that is so that is so awesome man i had no idea you were going to throw in one of those that is like Man, I love Tom Mollica. Let me just, just right off the top, one of my favorite effects that he does, which David Blaine picked up, that is he has like a packet of 15 cards, right? And the lady names out like three. 
and he just kind of like flips them, and he says, uh, look under you. I, I'm trying to think how it goes, but she ends up like sitting on three cars or something like that. And so, and then he goes through that whole routine and each time, like, uh, whatever number they say, like that's the amount of cards that either they have under them or that's absent from the pack. So yeah, super great. Plus he has all the cool cigarette magic, right? Uh, which, you know, as a non-smoker, it's just fun to watch how he does that. Uh, swallows a lot of, a lot of tobacco. Is a lot of fun to watch. Wow, I am uh, <laughs> super excited about those, man. Thank you so much. Oh my gosh. The Tom Fullery. I believe USPCC put those out. I'm just going to stack them like that for now. Um, deck number two. Gosh, man, no way. Those steamboat playing cards. I've always wanted these. Um, yeah, they're borderless. They have a great design. Guys, we'll, we will do separate videos as far as each individual deck, and we will review it. Um, but yeah, because each of these decks deserve their own episode with their own review. Um, these are special cards. You know, they're a favorite uh, one of Daniel Madison's favorites, and for good reason. They're just uh, a great card, a great deck for the card table. Great borderless design. Obviously, blue sill, very old. It's like I'm stepping back in time. Triple nine, brand of the United States playing cards. Like, my voice is shaking because um, I'm just that excited. It's Wow, man, I can't wait to get these open, and I, I don't even know if I should open them. I want to. Um, yeah, we'll open them for sure. Uh, thank you, Craig. Man, I am uh, feeling really blessed right now. Christmas in July, uh, no doubt. Deck number three, guys, we're halfway there. Oh my gosh, just just that right there, that's, that's more than it. Craig, you've already outdone yourself. Um, man... This is just insane. Guys, also stay tuned. Keep an eye um, on Craig's channel because I know there's some interesting things coming up. You're going to want to stick around. and uh, So keep a close eye on his channel. Oh my gosh, the blue steamboats to go with the red. How awesome is that? Not only... The red, but we have the blue now as well. Matching blue seal. Um, yeah. Old ad copy. That is so exciting. Both of the designs are beautiful. It's almost like a snowflake um, design that's a full bleed. And it's actually like on the steamboat, they have that thing on the back. I don't know what it's called, but I think that's actually what it is. Like this wheel with spokes. It's basically like paddles kind of I don't know what I'm saying but uh, that's I think the design of the card and it's just a beautiful design um thank you Craig that's that's excellent man okay guys we're on deck number four man this is it's just insane man like you you've been Craig has been so generous and so kind um what a blessing I mean how excellent is this? Guys, the original stud playing cards. The blue seals. Um, you know, I have a pack of studs somewhere, but they're the new kind. And they have just a really coarse, um, stiff stock. And I know, just automatically with this blue seal uh, from Cincinnati, these cards are going to be insane. They're going to handle so great. Um, I love studs. I love using the ones that I have that are stiff. Uh, so now having these, super excited, uh, super thankful. Um, thank you, man. That's that's great. This is such a desirable deck to have. Um, you know, I always hear people talking about it. 
I read about it in forums. Su super thankful, man. We got the stud playing cards, the red. Whew. Oh, man, I feel like I gotta sit down and take a... I might have to take a puff off my inhaler. Uh, wow, that's... Alright, guys. And for the fifth... What was that? That's the sound of a cat outside. Okay, so I think there's a cat fight about to happen. Yeah. Okay, that was uh, unexpected. Wow. Do you hear those cats moaning and meowing like that? Yeah, that was a cat fight about to happen out there. I'm glad I got my kitties um, away in their area. They have their own front porch area. Okay, guys, so deck number five. Oh my gosh, no way. I I know immediately what this is, man. No, you didn't. Oh my gosh. No way. This is the version one mint playing cards. Full bleed. Like, I'm shaking holding these. Like, these, you can't even find these anymore. I mean, there's a few out there. I think there were only ever a thousand printed. Um, maybe a little bit more, but man, from Assad with uh, 52 cards, uh, these are the mint playing cards, the V1s. Um, this was the, like you can only get these cards if you got the first two versions or something like it was a special, kind of like an add-on, kind of like with the V2s, if you got the blueberry and the, and the green or the cucumber, and you could get the frost, which is the borderless. So the black is... To, to the bordered cards, V1s, what the Frost borderless is to the V2, the, the Blueberry and Cucumber. I, I hope that makes sense. These go for no less than 100 Like, you can't find these for under $100, man. That's insane. I will cherish these cards, man. You have no idea how excited I am. Um, yeah, limited edition right there on the, on the sill. That is insane. I've only dreamed about these cards. Like, it, <laughs> a little bit of ad copy on the bottom. We'll, we'll definitely be doing a deck review on, on each one of these decks. Man, that, that has been... Like, I have to... Like, I'm literally going to have to go find my inhaler because uh, I'm having a hard time breathing. Uh, I, I don't... I can't take any more. Like, i very thankful, very grateful, very humbled excited i didn't know what to expect craig you're a stand-up guy um thank you for your kindness and generosity guys if you haven't ran over and checked out craig's channel i would encourage you to go over and just show him some love he has some interesting videos a really cool tannins mystery box unboxing that's uh, really cool really unique so guys there you have it a half a brick of playing cards Right there with the little tiny mini goat standing guard. How beautiful are all these? Every one of these. Um, I am just thrilled. And like I said, we still have to do a uh, a video reviewing these. These are the blue seals that Craig sent me separately um, from the from the original box that I that I. Uh, that I have shown on video. So, yeah, we're going to do deck reviews on each of these. These are all vintage, except for these. These are modern, but they are already at vintage rare status. Um, yeah, so, once again, guys, thanks for stopping by and checking this out. Thanks again, Craig. Um, God bless. I'm going to go find my inhaler.